Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back. So I finally bought some lashes from AliExpress. I haven't, I didn't buy them. I've been like stalling on buying them because I was just scared of how they were gonna look and because of the shipping, like every time I needed lashes, I needed them like right then and there. So I decided like a month ago to order some lashes just to test them out to see which ones I like that way I could reorder so I decided to get five lashes that were I think uh, mink they were only I think like two dollars and like 50 cents or two it wasn't over three dollars and they are really stinking cute and I also bought these packs of lashes from them and I have bought from three sellers, so I, I'm hoping that I'll be sure to like put everything down below in the description so that way you guys could see. And then I bought this one that was like in like this big pack. But um, I'm gonna be trying them on for you guys so that way you guys could see how it looks. I don't like big lashes on myself, but I swear online these looked it way more natural than they do here these and these they looked it more natural so the the pack of lashes the name of them is called f830 and that's these and they're more natural the next pack is f820 and that's this one the other one is G806, and these are the really dramatic ones. And the pack that looks like a flower is called G200. So the other mink lashes I bought, I have them in D21. And I think the packaging is really cute. It has a plastic, like, thing that you could like slide out and then slide back in it's not like a flip lid and the next one is D08 wait yeah D08 D23 A21 And D03. I'm gonna start off by trying off the more dramatic ones just to get them out the way because they're scaring me a little bit. So I'm gonna start off with the G0 G806, and that's these the one that came in the pack. First, you wanna measure them. Ooh! Dramatic. So I'm just gonna cut off a little bit of each one. So I think the dramatic ones are gonna do one of each. on each eye so I'll put this one on this eye and then I'll switch on the other eye just do the other one so they are going on really good like I'm not having to um I guess like finesse them a little bit and that's because they have like a really good curve to it or any lash that has like a really good curve slightly stiff I feel like goes on pretty good and I chose to leave eyeliner on because I normally don't wear thick banded um, lashes and when I do I mean when I do wear lashes they're pretty thin and they kind of blend in with my eyelash but these, I said, let me put liner on so that way they could look a little bit more decent. All right, so these are the G806. 
So they're not too bad once they're on. I feel like in the pan it looks worse. But personally, for my eye shape, I wouldn't wear these. But I would wear I would put these on and suggest them to people who have like a bigger eye shape. Because I feel like my hooded eyes, they feel like they look too close. See, like when I go like that, <laughs> it looks so much better. But they still are like really dramatic, but they're not bad. So I would definitely use these on my dramatic clients. But they're not too bad. I actually do like them. Alright, so I'm going to put the F820s. On this eye, I don't feel like I want to do both eyes with the same lash. I already pretty much know how it looks with that one side. So I'm going to do this one with the F820s. Alright, so these are the F820s and I like them way better than the first pair. See how much they suit my eye? Like you see the difference how this closes up my eye? I have hooded eyes, so like hooded eyes or like Asian eyes, like that really like hooded look. I personally, personally like this style better. But some people do like this dramatic look, but I guess it's fine if you just wear like liner or something, but for me, no. I like these so much better. I feel like I really do like them. They were reminding me of the Ardell's double, double something, double wispies, double something. I think it was like 507s, something like that. It was like one of my favorites, but they look similar to that one. But they're still cute. And I'm, I actually don't think they feel heavy neither. Like considering that this is like way dramatic, it doesn't feel like I have a lot on my eye. I just feel like right here is giving me like some, something's like right there, but I think it's because the glue is not dry. But other than that, I really do like this side way better. All right, so I'm gonna put these on the F830 on this eye. Alright, so these are definitely way more natural. Even like, this is like an everyday eyeliner, out the door real quick kind of makeup look. And lashes, if you want to pop some on. Because this looks really natural. Even for me, like I feel like I will wear this without liner. So I can see it's just a tad bit more in here. But they still are cute, they're just like too natural. I feel like in here, it just looks like really thin hair. But they're okay, I guess. All right, so these are the G200s. They're like a little bit more stiffer than the other ones. And like I said, they are really curled up. So I don't really like these because see how right here is a little bit too long for my lashes. Like I like that when some lashes taper shorter towards the inner corners, but these don't. Some people like that, but I don't like it. So I would rather wear the first pair that were really dramatic than these because I feel like these just look too stiff and like up. All right, so now for the fun lashes, I'm gonna start with the least dramatic up to the dramatic out of the five pairs. And the next one I am gonna try is D23. That are, that's these. These are the D20, D, yeah, D23s. Alright, so these are the D23s. I think they, re they really look cute. And they really look like natural hair. See, especially like in there. 
I really do like these. The only thing, they're a little uncomfortable because I forgot. I didn't cut enough off. So right here, it's kind of like poking me, but I'm just going to have to cut some off. But they are super cute. Alright, and I'm going to do the same thing. I'm just going to do this eye with a different lash. That way I'm not here all night. you already seen how I applied one lash, so it's pretty much the same thing on the other side. All right, so these are D21s. I'm gonna put that on this eye. All right, so these are D21s and these are D23s. And this one, of course, it does start off short and then it gets longer, like a cat eye. And this one is more of like an even look but it's still a little bit shorter on this side but and then it does get longer and a little bit thicker so that's why this one looks a little bit more dramatic than this one but I do really like both of them I'm really liking these because I really thought they were gonna be like a little bit too dramatic on me that's why it always took me so long to purchase them but I'm pretty satisfied so far all right so these are D zero threes all right so these are more thinner as you can see how thin they are you could pretty much see my eyelid so these would be perfect for like a, uh, a if you're doing like a more of a like a creative look and you want to be able to see the eyeshadow but still have lashes on these would be perfect so they're not as bad as I thought it was gonna be like in the inner corner they still are long but it's not really bothering me all right so the next two look pretty dramatic side by side they do look similar so I feel like this one starts off with the short in the inner corner and goes longer and this one is more even. So see how it has like that shorter piece and shorter piece and then like the long ones in the middle. So hopefully you can see the difference. So these are the A21s. But these are pretty dramatic. See how I feel like I should have brought it this way more maybe. But they still are really cute. Just a little bit too dramatic for me. Again, someone with like a bigger eye, I would put this on. Or if I just... Like they're not as bad, but... I feel like I would like it a little bit toned down more, but they still, I think they're, they still are really cute. I feel like I like these better than the other ones that came in like that white packaging. These are the D08s and these are the A21s. Um, I don't really see a difference when they're on. Um, I do think this one is still a little tad bit shorter towards the inner corners. Um, but I feel like everything else still looks the same. Maybe a little bit more like gappy on this one. I don't know if you guys can see that. But I know it's like a little bit more gappier than this one. But they both are really cute. Again, for someone who likes this more of a dramatic look. Um, I think they're really cute but I just personally won't put them on myself. Okay, so overall, I do like the lashes, especially the ones that come in the plastic kits. I'm gonna be sure to link that link for this. I guess the seller or wherever I got it from, I have to log into my AliExpress account and be sure to link that down below because those I really recommend. I feel like I got they do have other different like types of lashes, but these are the only five that I decided to get. I wasn't sure how dramatic they were going to be in person, but I do like the um, the selection that I bought. Except like these two, of course, like I would definitely put these on more 
of a bigger eye shape but they still are a cute and as for the ones that came in that packaging these were okay the F a F830 but more for like an everyday natural look these I feel like look really cheap in the contain like in this the packaging but on the eye I feel like it didn't look as cheap as they look they actually look better on their eye I still prefer the other ones that were in the in the plastic packaging better than these these I don't really like I feel like they look nice in the packaging but I feel like they still have too much of a curve to them so it kind of looks unnatural so I wouldn't recommend those but yeah I'm a, hopefully I just link everything down below that way everybody could just take a look at them and see because these surprise me very much I feel like I've always heard people talk about them but like I'm like eh, I didn't really give in to the hype but now I feel like I'm gonna buy them for myself and like for my maybe for my regulars too um, I hope you guys enjoy this video and I hope to see you on the next one